right, welcome to the Bird Bro Sparrow Riff at Sparrow Stravaganza. It's Sparrow time. We got some cool sparrows for you today. Some that aren't normally seen on the East Coast, but we caught them here in Ontario. Let's go check them out. Let's get our sparrow on. Action. Got a rare bird alert. Yellow Crown Sparrow. On our way there now, see if we can see it. Uh, unfortunately, Sean cannot make it with me today. So you snooze, you lose, buddy. Hopefully we see it though, and I can get him some footage to watch. See you there. Cut. It's super windy out! But we're still looking for the sparrow! I think it's over there in the bushes! That's what the lady says! Oh hot damn, there it is! Ain't that a beaut? That's a lifer bird for me! Look at that golden crown! Must be a king! Or a prince in the, the Sparrow Dynasty. Just a few pics I snapped of it. Action. <laughs> well, just saw the Golden Crown Sparrow, rare visitor from the West Coast. Now to Hamilton to try for the Harris's Sparrow. See you there. Just parked in this uh, school here off Ink Center Road. Got, I don't know, three, four hundred meters to walk to the, the supposed seed pile of the Harris's Sparrow. This seems to be the spot where a couple of the birders have gathered. Oh, look, a blue jay. It's making a funny sound. You hear that? I wonder, I wonder what it's doing that for. Oh, weirdo. Well, there's tons of little sparrows flutting around here, eh? What do we got going on here in the sparrow kingdom? What's that one? Oh, American Tree Sparrow. That's actually the first one I've seen this year. It's pretty gnarly. So a good way to tell is like their lower part of the beak, the lower mandible there. It's yellow, and the top, the upper mandible is uh, like a dark, dark color. And the, the cap on the top of its head, it really pops, a roofsy brown color. Oh, that's a field sparrow there on the right. That's pretty uncommon to see at this time of the year. Cool, that's a bonus sparrow. I always can tell them apart from other sparrows because I got that, that full color, like, shitty orange color beak it's the full white eye ring orbital ring as they say in the books around the eye there oh, hold on this you could probably tell what this one is without me telling you but I'll tell you it's a white throated sparrow I'm not going to tell you why they call it that you're going to have to figure that one out on your own but pretty cool also the first one I've seen this year it's not bad. The yellow marks, that's a, uh, call those yellow lures. Lures. Oh, and this, this little puke of a sparrow here is a house sparrow. They're invasive. Oh, there's a dark eyed jungle, you know, they're also sparrows. Ah. The target bird has at last appeared. The Harris's Sparrow. Now, these sparrows look like the Calico Cat of Sparrows. And they got the orange legs and the orange beak. They're kind of a cool sparrow, and they're a little on the larger side, too. Anyway, here's some pics of all the sparrows I saw.
Oh, we got the Harrison Sparrow. That's two sparrows for the day that are uncommon. Also a field sparrow. Suck a Sean, say what? All right, so I'm at an undisclosed place here in Cambridge where apparently there's a golden crown sparrow. John just told me about this. He saw it earlier this morning. And of course, I'm not gonna go let him see a bird without me going and seeing it too. I'm not gonna let him one-up me like that. Right guys? Yeah. So there's been a golden crown sparrow in Toronto for the past couple weeks, but doesn't have a golden crown. This one here has a golden crown. So I decided to come out and film it because you know what? I didn't want to show you a golden crown sparrow without a golden crown, but we got the opportunity today. So let's get on it. Let's go find it. All right, so I had to snoop around this guy's yard to uh, try to find the sparrow, and uh, he wasn't home, so it's kind of sketchy. Looks like this dude's got some peacocks in his yard. In the winter time, the peacock's feet can get cold and get frosted, so it's important to have a good shelter. Oh, so it looks like we got a winter favorite here, the Janko. Oh, I mean Junko, but uh, they're pretty janky birds. Dark-eyed Junko is a, a small sparrow. Oh, and would you look, there's a little downy woodpecker there. Don't care, I want to see the golden ground sparrow. Where is this bird? Oh, huh, look, there's a dude, maybe he sees it. Let's zoom in and check it out. Whoa, target acquired. The Golden Crown Sparrow. This is a pretty cool sparrow. I'm not normally out looking for sparrows, but for this one here, I definitely keep an eye out for him, amongst all the other sparrows. Oh, it flew up on the peak. According to the homeowner, apparently it lights it up there. It's right on the peak of the shed right now. Oh, just flew off. All right, so we just saw the Golden Crown Sparrow. That was pretty cool. It was very cold, very windy, but uh, there's a ton of other feeder birds there too. It was cool to see the other sparrows, the goldfinches, the chickens, the peacocks, everything there. And uh, I didn't let John get one bird up on me, so that, that's good. We uh, made that happen today, guys. Mission accomplished. Hope you enjoyed that Golden Crown Sparrow. The gentleman that lives here, very, very nice. He's a pretty cool dude, and... He let us see it, so that's cool with me. And uh, I hope that you guys get the chance to maybe come and see it too. Who knows? Might still be around by the time we post this video. But probably not. Stay fly. Yeah, thanks for tuning in. Uh, I'm glad you got to see it too, Sean. Awesome. Uh, anyways, guys, take care. So, if you folks enjoyed that video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and uh, share it or whatever you want to do. Uh, until next time, folks, stay fly.